In this week's video, I'm going to be challenging myself to wake up at 5 a.m. every day for a week. I'm going to be sharing my thoughts on how this overall went coming from someone that is not a morning person and if it's worth waking up at 5 a.m. black outside this makes me not want to get up like at all It is so early for this, but I literally just can't get up without the sun being up. It is so hard to. Like, I don't know why I should even be up because I don't know what to do. So that's why I'm like trying to find things that I can do to make me feel like I have a reason to be up right now. And this is so, so cold. I'm just trying to use this so I can wake up because right now I am so sleepy. It's actually getting a little bit brighter out so i guess it's sunrise time it's currently 6 a.m i just finished writing my journal i literally want to go back to sleep so bad but i'm trying to do things that will keep me awake so right now i'm gonna do some yoga <laughs> more like energized and i actually feel good like throughout so if you have been thinking about doing any type of yoga use this yoga video because it is so good morning yoga practice can calm you down it helps improve mental focus and concentration control your breathing your brain gets a load of oxygen this will increase your mental clarity and ensure that you prepared for work and can give your full attention and work with maximum efficiency which i think is so so good to do in the morning and i regularly do it in the morning i just don't do it like every single day so i'm I'm gonna be trying to do it every single morning for this video because i'm obviously waking up at 5 a.m and i have literally nothing to wake up for so i think waking up at 5 a.m and doing some yoga is gonna be very helpful i feel like it's gonna be hard but i feel like once you get into it it's not as hard as you think it is water bottle last night and there's like nothing in here literally empty wow i was dehydrated to turn off all my alarms and now they're just like all going off this is like the worst feeling when you get up and the alarm goes off oh my gosh Five thirty a.m it was honestly 50 50 of waking up like i could not get out of bed but at the same time i was doing really good like my alarm didn't go off at five on my phone it only went off on my sunrise alarm clock so i turned it off like i turned off my sunrise clock and then it went off at like 506 and then it went off at 510 and then i was like you know what i need to get up so like i think i went i got up at like 511 that's when the other alarm went off i was this close to not getting up today i feel like my body's just really not used to waking up at 5 a.m i think this is just so early for me i forgot what these are called but i think you do this 
and oh, this feels good. Oh my god, where you are literally pooping. It says that it's a 40% chance of rain, but I'm literally hearing thunderstorms. I live in Florida and it's been raining so much because it's like hurricane season. It's literally raining every single day. <laughs> the rest to my dad like literally look how much cold foam is left and i literally can't fit anything so i'm just gonna keep adding until it keeps going down and i have space to add more cold foam because i don't want to throw it away i use this heavy whipped cream and milk and this vanilla syrup it's just it's so good i'm like addicted and i need this because i need energy i'm gonna do some yoga try to go to sleep at this time i just wanted to talk about my day so basically i woke up this morning i don't feel like i'm getting used to the time but i had no motivation to get up it was literally raining that just made me more sleepy not making me want to get up at all i did some yoga and that was actually pretty exhausting but it did wake me up i'll have it linked down below but that was like an exhausting little like mini workout literally felt like a workout because i was so sweaty after that but i used my bible app i took a shower and then i made myself some breakfast i didn't really film that but after that i literally passed out like i literally was so exhausted and i feel like it's also because i'm not getting enough sleep like i'm literally getting four hours of sleep here we're talking about no sleep so that's why today we're making a change we're sleeping at 9 p.m and i'm gonna try to get the best beauty rest that i can feel like way better and so that i don't like need to take a nap or anything like that because i really feel like crap when i take a nap it feels like i didn't even wake up early and then i wake up at 12 p.m and i'm like why did i do that like i just feel extremely exhausted that i just don't have energy to stay up and i literally have nothing to do early in the morning i feel like that's also another thing like what am i supposed to do in the morning i do yoga i do some bible studying and then once i'm done with like all of my morning routine stuff it's about like 9 a.m and i'm just sitting in bed on my phone like there's absolutely nothing for me to do so that's something that i realized i feel like waking up at 5 a.m is just so unnecessary for me i feel like 7 a.m i'm just gonna stick with that anyways i'm gonna get some sleep and i will see you guys tomorrow at 5 a.m three more days we got this <laughs> go to sleep last night and i went to bed so oh so early and i'm just dead right now like i really need more sleep i think the reason why i can't fall asleep fast is because i'm so used to one certain time and it's like 11 p.m i feel like 9 p.m is just super early i'm like i can't do that and i also did take a nap yesterday so it was like a five hour nap anyways let's get up day four wait no, no. day three <laughs> helps so much to wake up like if you are struggling waking up definitely recommend drinking water and like get a cute water bottle or something because it definitely does a difference when you have like a cute water bottle it makes you feel like you want to drink faster whether you like drinking from a straw and i just like it like this i can also add a straw in it if i ever wanted to but yeah this is from lululemon right now i'm going to write in my wellness journal which i've talked about it before in my videos but i'm gonna be doing the morning part today journaling just definitely helps with releasing emotions setting intentions or just being like grateful like practicing gratitude and that's what i'm going to be doing today i have a wellness journal so it already has everything planned out for me like what i'm going to be talking about we're just gonna fill this out <laughs>
some yoga and I feel so good right now. I'll have it linked down below like one of my favorites. I always do this one. It just makes me feel so at peace. It doesn't make me feel exhausted like yesterday. I feel so much more relaxed and I feel like I can go throughout the day at ease for some reason. But anyways, it is currently 6.25 and the sun's going up. I can see it's getting bright out. I look who wants to come back in my room. day and i'm just so happy because honestly i don't know if i can do this every single day maybe i can do this like three times a week but other than that like i need my sleep ins like i need to sleep and i can't wake up at five every single day <laughs> and this would have been so bad. but I just want to talk about how I feel because it is the last day and I'm not going to be doing this tomorrow because I just want to sleep in like I literally just want to wake up at my own time instead of like having to wake up at 5 a.m. and not knowing what to do you know but I would say that waking up at 5 a.m. has honestly helped build a better relationship with myself like spending time alone and like it's kind of like self-care because I was journaling I was doing yoga I was reading my bible I was just doing everything to better myself and honestly I feel so amazing like throughout the one thing I would say is that I keep taking naps and I feel like that's not okay like what is the point of waking up at 5 a.m. if you're gonna take a nap so I definitely want to work on that but I feel like it all starts with my sleep so that's something else that I need to work on like last night I fell asleep at 1 a.m. and I could not fall asleep I was trying so hard to fall asleep but I could not and I just know that nap is coming through today like it's gonna be a good nap I should not be excited about that because honestly I should just like get to work but I have nothing else to do so that's why I take take naps but anyways overall i would say definitely try to do this you can even do it for like a day and see how it goes maybe build a routine maybe your routine might be different and you can do so much in the morning but for me all i could really do is yoga journal study the bible and if i have some work on my laptop i'll do it but most of the times i don't because i like to do it during the day instead of in the morning because it's really just like a day type of thing for me like work which when i say work i mean youtube so like my job is youtube and replying to emails and editing i feel like it's just a day type of thing and it's always been stuck in my head like that's my routine in the morning i don't like going on my laptop i don't like doing anything that has to do with editing or just looking at emails but sometimes i will but most of the times i don't i like to work on myself i like to do yoga i like to work out in the morning i just try to incorporate that with waking up at 5 a.m and i try to do my own routine and honestly i would say i feel really good and i thought it was, was gonna be like terrible and i was complaining throughout the way but honestly i just feel like this helped me so much I'm more than i like think i know anyways i gave them treats and that's why you could probably hear them like chewing on something mal is so loud when she chews on something this tea is honestly so good my mom actually got this so i am thanking her for letting me use her tea she has like a whole collection i don't even know where it's from i think it's from amazon but she was like so excited about it and i was like can i use it because i've been wanting to drink tea and i only drink 
drink matcha and like electrolyte mix so i was like you know what i'm gonna try the tea i put some sugar in it because it was so nasty and i don't even know if i used to put sugar back then when i would drink my teas but anyways it tastes good that's all that matters and now let's do some yoga it is also 6 26 and the sun is going up i was walking up the stairs and i could see the sunrise 